Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Oblivion. We are currently northeast of Leowen with the Orc Mazoga, helping her reach Fisherman's Point, where there is apparently someone that she needs to speak to. Mazoga just kills it in one hit. Love it. We were heading there at the end of the last episode. We came across a deer, which was badly injured. So I attacked it because I wanted the venison. And uh, it turned out it was being hunted by a legionary woodsman and for some reason attacking the deer triggered Mazoga into attacking the legionary woodsman. We got into an epic battle which Mazoga lost. So we had to load and continue and start again this episode. So here we are. Some Nermia over here. I believe that's Fisherman's Point just up there. See if there's any more Nern route around here before we head up. Okay, Fisherman's Rock, here we are. Let's see what Mazoga has to say for herself. Wherever she is, where the fuck is she? She's down there for some reason, what are you doing? save it over this one because I think we're going to have an epic battle on our hands with like three or four people remember me no who are you I'm Mazoga you killed my friend Ravindra I don't know what you're talking about you're a lying bastard you killed Ravindra and now I'm going to kill you Holy shit, that hurts. Mazoga's already killed one of them. I just need to keep these two busy while Mazoga kills the topless guy. Drive by! Drive by, hit him a bit. Mazoga's killed another one. Right, I just need to keep him distracted while Mazoga fucks him up from behind. Yeah, nice one. We got him together. <laughs> Bring around the rosy. Got him. I kept my oath. Mogan's windshifter is dead. Good work, lady. Mogan's windshifter had a gang. They robbed and killed travelers. But Ravindra saw and told the guards. Mogan's got away. But first he killed Ravindra. My best friend. Ravindra. Well, you fucking decked him, lady. That day, I became a knight and swore a knight's oath. Mm -hmm. I searched a long time and asked everyone. Then I finally heard he was hiding at Fisherman's Rock. Yeah, we know the rest. We helped you find him. So now you know everything. You helped me, and I won't forget. Okay. Take what you want from the dead. I came to keep my oath, and now I'm done. Cool, will do. When I saw my friend killed, I swore I'd be a true knight and right all wrongs. So now I gotta do some good deeds. Okay, okay. 
I don't know much about being a knight, but I'm gonna learn. Say, you did me a good deed. You ought to be a real knight yourself. I'm an adventurer. It's better. It's one up. You're a pal. Thanks. You're a diva. Uh, and this one... This one got owned instantly. Oh, she was an archer, that's why. What did this guy have on him? A steel dagger. Potion of cure paralysis. How are you supposed to use a potion of cure paralysis? You'd be par paralyzed. It's a bit silly. Okay, that's them all dead. Anything in this tent? Oh, there's a bag. No. Where'd she go? She left. Okay, I'll just check along here, see if there's any more known route, and then we'll uh, continue. Whoop. Audio seems to have dropped out at some point. Audio for the healing magic, I mean. Fort Redman. Any. Just a mud crab. Oh shit, my fucking. Got to repair my weapon. Yeah, Flumbe mud crab. broke all of that instantly. <laughs> all five of them broke immediately. There should be some more learn routes somewhere around here, right? Maybe not. Maybe gl growing in here. There's going to be enemies in here though, I think. Definitely an enemy somewhere. Looks like goblins to me. Or maybe not. Oh, someone's fighting someone. What are you fighting? Oh, a slaughterfish. Nice. Oh, what's the matter? Ow! She hurts, she really hurts. She hurts quite a bit. I want to go get the slaughterfish tail, uh, scales. Uh oh. Oh, the mud crab came in and fucked me up as well. <laughs> Okay, there's nothing in there, so let's just, you know, as far as I know, there's nothing in there. So let's just head back. Uh, let's use the hammers to repair everything again. Uh, let's head back to Leowin. Level up. Head to the Mages Guild where we can sleep and rest. Get in and out of this horrible weather. No. Oh, that's the guy who I was talking about who um, gives you the mission. So let's pick it up while we're here. 
Excuse me. Perhaps you're an adventurer? Yes, I Could am. Could you assist me in acquiring something for my crystal collection? Sure, why not? Straight to the point, eh? Good, I like that. I'm searching for some specific crystals known as Garadan's Tears. Okay. If you can locate these objects for me, I'd pay handsomely for each one. Yeah, tell me more. Wonderful. I had a good feeling about you from the moment that I saw you. Oh, that's just my face. I have that effect I on people. I want you to bring me as many of Garidan's tears as you can find. If you do, I will pay you a fair bounty in gold for each one. I don't want gold. I want powerful magical items. I confess, I have a weakness for crystals of a magical nature. And I must add these to my collection. Okay. This is a personal errand, you must understand. Just between you and I. The Mages Guild has nothing to do with it. Okay. The tears are not just a namesake. They're literally the frozen tears of a knight named Garadan Stalrus, who lived many years ago. Interesting. I'm not certain what happened to the knight. Or why the tears were frozen. But I do know someone you could ask. Okay, who's that? Seek out Juliana Fanis at the Arcane University in the Imperial City. She oversees the Alchemy Headquarters there. Cool. If anyone can help you get more information about these crystals, she can. Mm-hmm. Okay, no problem. The tears are small crystals. Bluish in appearance. Quite beautiful, I'd imagine. Not only has neck. Mm. Bring my salutations to Juliana. Safe journey to you. I need somewhere to sleep, oh, I do. Mage Guild basement. Iron Greaves. I'll take all this stuff so I can sell it. Ooh, lock fit, yes please. Lock fit, yes please. Need somewhere to sleep. This is a library. Tears for I'll come and loot all this in between episodes chat and turn it all into potions. Don't want to waste too much time doing that again. This playthrough. Is there seriously no beds for me to sleep on? Where the fuck does everyone keep their spare bedroom? This is not a spare bedroom. 
Must be in the basement. Must be all the way down in the basement. Let's go. Where is it again? Right through here, isn't it? Yeah. Got a spare bed. I'm absolutely knackered. Yeah, here we go. See if we can find new repair hammers in here. No. Six in the morning, I'll sleep for two hours and then get up and go self. You've done things the hard way without taking risks, taking responsibility for failure. How could you have understood? Ugh, just a three on endurance, that's annoying, but a five on willpower, I'll take that. And then two on strength, yes please. Still fucking pissing it down, eh? Where am I going? Over this way. To the shops. We'll see. Likes admiration, hates that. So he likes the top right. That's pretty good. Re it, you're, f you're good. What can I interest you in? I am good. Iron dagger, iron mace, iron short sword, That's steel dagger, you've made steel short sword, steel short sword, bronze necklace, copper rings, fur boots. A good. You. That's. You. A good. You got. No, I don't want to give that away. Iron Greaves, we can sell for a helmet. We That's can. a good deal. How are you supposed to use that if you're paralyzed? Actually, no, we'll keep that on us. Because I think if you're paralyzed, you can drink it and just get up immediately. Which is actually really quite useful. Common soul gem, lesser soul gem, That's petty soul gem, silver nug. Uh, we want to buy a bunch of repair hammers because we don't have that many. Do we have any more in stock yet? He does not. Thank you. Let's go next door to the armorer. What do you What can I interest you in? All your repair hammers, please. Farewell. Alright, what are the quests do we have to do in Leowin? Raid on Greyland and Mazoga the Orc, and that's it. So let's go back to Chaden Hall. Not Chaden Hall. Uh, Leowin Castle, even. Down here, 
Unless it grabbed it already. Whoa, she's increased. She's beefed up. I must. She must have beefed up when I leveled up. She's now wearing steel armor. Hope you've been successful. Have you learned why the orc? Such vengeance is a noble deed. Leowin thanks you for your service, and I have a fitting reward for such noble deeds. Is it gold, I suppose? I address my offer to you and your friend. Would you like to become knights errant? Sure, why not? I have created a chivalric order of the White Stallion. Find and kill the leader of the Black Bow Bandits, the orc named Black Rugo. Okay. If you succeed, I will bestow on both you and Mazoga the titles of Knights Errant of the White Stallion for your service to Leowin. Cool. The people have a simple faith in the Nine. Okay. The outlaw, Black Brugo, is a menace to County Leowin. They call his marauders Black Bow Bandits because they use black bows. Mm, you don't say. Find Black Brugo and execute him for his crimes, and I will make both you and your friend Mazoga knights errant of the White Stallion. She'd like that. In her shadowy past, your friend Mazoga might have had contacts with outlaws. Ask her. Okay, that's a good idea. Remember. Hello, friend. Thank you again for your help. You're welcome. I know Brugo. Long ago, back before I became Sir Mazoga. I split a share or two with Brugo. Okay. Brugo's a jerk. He's got a hideout in a ruin called Telepi. Every night between midnight and 6 a.m., he stops there to pick up his take. Okay, so let's go there early, kill everything, Paths, and right? wait, lay an ambush so for we'll him. So we'll kill Black Brugo and be knights. I'll wait right here until you ask me to follow you. I guess we want to save it and give that a go. If you're ready to go get... Let's go. We're going to need to pick up a, a healing spell. From the uh, chapel before we go. Please Solana Blandia, spell. healer of. Uh. Things go from bad to worse nowadays. Sharina is good with a. Why don't any of you I'm priests Avras have Avras. spells to say? I'm the so. priest of Zenithar at the lake. Oh, he does good. Have a look around. Convalescence. You won't find better prices in all. Restore health, time. fifteen points on target. Okay, so we need that. Superior convalescence, no, that's too much. We'll take convalescence and heal greater wounds. Restoration skill of 50. How much Come is our back. restoration skill at the moment? What's our restoration skill right now? 38, yeah, we're not going to get that for a while, and we need a better healing spell. What? So we'll take the other one, we'll Have take the weaker one, we'll take heal major sure wounds. I'm heal major wounds can be one. 
convalescence can be th three. Flare can be two. Farewell. Right, with that, we should be able to... Oops. Right, we should be able to heal her now when she gets damaged, so she should be able to survive what's coming next. No problemo. What are you doing standing there? I'm saving up enough for some... Okay. Rodris has been teaching Fighters Guild members how to... Okay, so we want Raid on Greyland now. There's Greyland, we just need to go inside and kill everything inside. Stash Wipe the skooma, learn the recipe, and then we can start selling it. That's the master plan, chat. There's literally nothing around there, okay. Okay, so we're going to need to heal her. We're going to hide behind her, let her do the fighting and just keep her alive. I got the hit. I got the finishing blow. Yay. I did something. I healed my friend and I got the winning blow. Where did her sword go? Damn it, her sword went somewhere as well. I wanted her sword. Oh, it's here. Just an iron long sword. Okay. Good work. Good thing you had that armor. I'll heal up Mazoga first because she's the one who does the fighting. Okay, she's fully healed now. Now I'll heal myself. Right, we need to find that skooma stash. There'll be a stash of skooma around here somewhere, probably in that chest. Well, that was pretty easy. Wouldn't have been without her though, obviously. You're welcome. By the divines. I salute you in the name of the Legion. Here is your well-earned reward. It's like tw 20 gold. Are you fucking kidding? Is that it? A fucking joke. I guess the longer you leave it and the higher your level, the better, the more dangerous he is and the better the equipment he has. And then also the uh, more gold you get as a reward. What did we get from him? What item did we get? Claymore of Frost. Ah, it's not very good. Five points of frost damage on strike. Meh. Nah. I'm just going to sell it. Mm. 
Yes? Can I interest you in some of... 67 gold is all he gets. Oh, I didn't repair Thank this you. stuff. Yay! Your pair hammers now last twice as long. That's good. Goodbye. Yes? Let's do business. That seems a fit. You've made a good bit of gold. I have indeed. I'll keep the 17 Thank repair you. hammers on me. Right, let's go do the actual Black Bruno quest. We'll clear out his hiding place. Well, what time is it? Soon, 12 in the afternoon. Yeah, we've got 12 hours. 12 hours before he arrives, chat. So we'll go clear out his den, kill everyone around it, and then set up an ambush for him. Sorry, I must check. You got nothing else for me, you fucking asshole. 20 measly gold on this skooma bandit. It was pathetic. Nope. Camp. There's the bandit. Uh -huh, Miss me. I'll distract him. from behind, Mazoga. Stop hitting the skeleton and kill the summoner. Fuck's sake, he can heal. He can heal, chat. I can heal too, bitch. Ow, the lightning hurts so much, chat. Yeah, got him. Good work, Mazoga. Why is the weather so horrible around here constantly? Anyone up there? I think there's usually an archer on the roof, isn't there, for this one? Let's find out. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Healing. Let's heal her up before we go into battle. It's stupid not to.
the Weaver's Ogre. Let's go sneak snonking. Sneak snonking into the ruin. see anyone. Anyone over this way? Oh, it's a shame, but looks empty on the left. Got two chambers. Ooh, a wel welkin stone. appear to be anyone here what the fuck so this place is supposed to be full of bandits there's literally no one in here no one in here Mazoga. what's going on what about over in this way what time is it We've got three hours. Uh, it's only three o'clock even. We've got like eight. Oh, okay, there's someone in here. We've got like eight hours before he arrives. Your presence here will not be tolerated. Two no. archers. You will know. Just what you want to kill. Sorry, I keep hitting um, Mazoga. Where the out where the dagger go, whatever. Good work, Mizoga. Oh, she's fine. Okay, any daggers anywhere? Don't see where the daggers went. Oh there it is, there's one. I heard the other dagger that she dropped. Can't see it. So maybe she's lying on it. Move your butt. Urgh, drag her by the ass. Nope. Not there. Okay, whatever. Eat potion of sorcery. Bread loaf. Take all their food so they starve to death. Slowly, chat. That's how we kill them. A nice slow, another iron dagger. A nice slow, painful death of agony and embarrassment. Looks like a welcome stone on the left. Bread here. Uh, bone meal. Nothing. An average chest. Nothing. Okay, let me get into this chest. Gold, eh? Push the button. That opens this, yep. And then we should have something in here. Locked. Average lock. Gotcha. 300 gold and a handwritten note. Nice. What's the handwritten note? Do, 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 do. Handwritten note, handwritten note, handwritten note, handwritten note. Handwritten note. Bruno's take 300 ducks, ready for Midas pickup after midnight. Okay. Well, we can just fuck them up when they come down the stairs then. Set up a nice little ambush for them in here. Um, let's repair everything. So much for repair hammers lasting twice as long. It's getting fucking exploding every single time we use them. 
How are we doing on weight? Yeah, weight's fine. Still got about 15 minutes before the end of the episode. We should be able to do this. Let's save, drop a save, and uh, wait until midnight. So that's eight hours. What the fuck? Where did you all come from? Oh shit, she's got fucking fire. Oh, she just side... She, so she side shot from the fucking... Okay, so waiting in there isn't a good idea because they appear behind you and we get ambushed. So it's probably best to... Well, actually, that's... Let's wait for an hour beforehand. Let's wait for seven hours. And then he should be coming through the door in about an hour. Hello? Yeah, yeah. So he's just coming through the door. Or it's not. Oh, shit. Oh, she fucking nailed me. <laughs> Look at my body. <laughs> just left lying over the pillar. Okay, so I'm going to wait on top of the pillar because they seem to spawn in behind you no matter what. So if I wait up here, if I get up on top of here, if I can. Nearly. I'm nearly making it. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Right. I can heal her from up here and fire at them with my steel bow. That's the master plan, chat. That's how we're going to do it. Seven hours, wait. It might be too much damage for her though, with three of them attacking her. Showing your face was the last mistake you ever made. Die, damn you! Well, two of them are swinging at me, so. Oh no, now they're all shooting at her. Yeah, she's gonna die. There's too much damage. Well... Too much damage for her to take, so we're gonna have to get in there. We're gonna have to. We'll use our ability. What we need to do is uh, come at them so they all get clogged up, like net bottlenecked. We need to bottleneck them. Come on, come back. I used my dragon skin too early. Don't charge them. Oh, I healed him instead of myself. Shit, we didn't spit up. Oh, she lightning blasted me. Fuck. Okay, so we need to take out the witch first. That's the main thing. We need to take out the witch with the lightning blast first. So I say we come out here. We have to come to here to get them to come out. So we... I thought they'd be coming down the stairs. So let's take... Let's go up here and take this corridor really narrow. Take this really narrow corridor and try and wait like that. I used my dragon thing too early as well then. Hello? Who's 
Come on, lady. You coming or what? Well, well, look who we've got here. They're just like, well, well, look who we've got here. I'm just gonna stay in here. Right, there you go, two arms. <laughs> You'll never take me down. I'm just warming up, you pathetic worm. Oh, I just tried to heal her. I just tried to heal her when she went down. It's close. I reckon we can do it if we get lucky. If she targets the right person, if she targets the right people, I reckon we can do it. But she needs to target the people without Aegis on them and kill them quickly and then I can heal her. Well, if it's a fight you want, it's a fight you'll get. Me, I need to tank what she kills. Uh, well, the thing is she keeps, ta she keeps targeting random people. So first you hit these guys. No, she died. She died to him. See, she, she targeted the wrong... She keeps targeting the wrong people. She, like, hits one person, then moves over and hits someone else, and then hits someone else, and then just runs into the middle of them and just starts hitting them randomly instead of focus firing on one of them and just killing one of them. Ideally, it would be the witch first. Because she's the one who does the most damage with her magic when she casts it. I need to just tank, basically. She so, just runs into the middle and goes after the main guy. And then the witch is stood behind her, fucking her up. Oh, okay. So, heal, convalescent. How's she doing? Is she alright? Yeah, that's how it's... We need to do some healing on her. Uh... I'm going to... We need to keep her alive. I missed. Yeah, we got him. We got him. Finally, good work. Black foe for Curious. Where did his weapon go? He had a Daedric weapon. Was that conjured? And I nailed her. So that I got her. So that's good because she didn't have Aegis on her. The, the spell Aegis on her. Um, let's heal myself up. I can only assume that his weapon... See, the reason why it worked that time was because I targeted the witch and she didn't have shield on her. So I killed Roxy. Meanwhile, she targeted this guy who doesn't have much armor and killed him. And that just left the main guy, Brugo, to, take, to be taken out. Oh, there it is. It was just an iron battle axe, really. Or maybe he only had an iron battle axe this time. Oh, and he had a curious... He had a... He had a special... Uh, what's it called? Special armor. Curious of resistance. Okay. 
Well, that went well. Iron battle axe, meh. Iron dagger. How much do we need to drop? We can drop four of them. And that's nearly it. Uh, we can drop the arena. Oh, we can drop these boots. They're not worth much. Fur helmet can go. And then we're under. I want to heal her before we go. Make sure she's fully healed. So he dropped... He had a key. I guess that was, that's open to all these... That's to open all these chests, I suppose. But we've already done it, so... Good work, Mazoga. Black Brugo is dead. I'll go back and wait in the county hall. No, come with me. Stay with me, Lake, please. You're almost dead. And I could do with your help getting back. Just heal her up. But guys, we've come to the end of the episode. We've come to that time where the hour is basically up. So I'm going to end things here. In the next episode, we'll travel back to Leowin, hand in this mission, and then move on from there. We'll probably move to another city. Uh, I like the idea of going to Bruma and selling a load of sign defense goods for the Thieves Guild again because I need lockpicks. Uh, I'd like to buy 100 lockpicks and the easiest way to do that, or the only way to do that is to go to Bruma. Where's she looking? Oh, there is a guy up there now. Why is there a guy up there now? Yeah, there he is. Did I save it yet? I want to save it in case Black Bruno comes back. I don't think I have time to kill this guy, especially because he's up on a high, difficult to get to place. Ow. <laughs> he fucking owned me. Yeah, guys, I have to end the episode there. In What I'll do is, in between episodes, uh, I'll kill this guy on the roof. I'll head back to Leowin. I will sell all the stuff I need to sell, and then I'm going to loot the Leowin uh, Mages Guild and the Le Leowin Fighters Guild for ingredients, make loads of potions, sell them, and then I'll pick up the episode and we'll hand in this mission. But, guys, thanks so much for hanging out today. I do hugely appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I've enjoyed playing. I'm going to be back tomorrow morning with another episode of Oblivion. Hopefully I'll see you there for that. If not, I'll try and catch you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now. So, sal wait till next time.